Oh, hey. <laughs> hey, Lois. <laughs> this is the pro. I'll okay, zoom in on him. Let's see how happy he is. You got here early, Eddie. He, yeah, he wanted a little documentation of his. I'm Steve. I'm the head of City Lawn. Whoa. Yeah, this is what the is the man is the man make me make me man. <laughs> he make man make my dream come true. Oh wow. Well, okay. Prisoners, prisoners. One of the world's great people. That's Thank why you. I'm so happy to be here. Thank you, man. teacher Hunter College and I'm so happy uh, my dream around the corner because my dream is for push kid and make school for the kid you know to live some life for the kid live some bridge build a bridge for kid build a bridge for my mother that's my mother dream that's why she put me out you know and I'm so happy you know to see my student, you know, take me to the for good souvenir. Anytime, anytime I see the tape, I'm gonna remember any. I love you. <laughs> no, my, you know. Hi, I love you, Green. Fisner, Mr. Augustine. So I'm so happy. My dream comes true. So today, I feel like. I'm born again because you know a lot of opportunity you know people give me you know all my students from Monte College all my students uh, from private class you know and I'm so happy so that thing I'm gonna take today is not for me it's for all my students and it's all for my family and all my neighborhood people I grew up with in Haiti. And it's for Haiti, special for Haiti because I'm from Haiti. You know, I'm Haitian. I'm gonna I'm proud of 
are from Haiti. God, God bless you, America. America make my dream come true. I love that. America, my dream come true. And this one is the beginning. There's going to be so many more. God bless you, America. I love myself. I love all my friends, all my students. All my students is similar like my roots, family, my life, my love. Because I teach my students and to keep my religion grow, to leave my rhythm grow. I feel like a tree. Leave some you know something for for children, for my students. I love that. Thank you. Thank you, Anna. <laughs> Steve wife. I see. So what are we? What are we? So, so thank you. Very Congratulations. Much. Thank you. Very much. <laughs> because now you make my dream come true. But you make my dream come true from long time. You know the time. You know and we got a lot of show coming on and you didn't want to pay me. Uh -huh. Big big for sure. Well, I'm so happy. You know I, I respect you. You respect me. And also you respect my roots. That's why I mean, you know, be with you today and to accept the award from you. Thank you for having me. Well, you're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> this is Prison Rock with Stan. Hi, this is Bob Girl. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So I'm so happy and still make my dream come true. My dream. You want to be here? Yes, to be. Well, he's a great person to be with, but he's a bigger dream. He's one of the great, 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 great. He's getting on to the next dream now. <laughs> okay. Okay. A, free, a free spirit in the world. So are we going to put it down? Yeah, that's a good one. See you on the weekend. Okay. I'm right here. Looks good, man. You got to carry it. I know. This is, this is, he got a suit especially for this occasion. So did I. That makes two of us. Thank you. Thank you. We need to get you one of those here. Because you know, because I feel uh, I'm born again. <laughs> That's why I was so today. You know, I was in my community. Let so, uh, me get uh, so today. That's a special day. Because I work hard, you know. That I was a little boy. But now I'm old. Yeah, we're all good. But I feel new. I feel, I feel I'm born again. Yeah, I, I feel just old. <laughs> no, no, not me. Not me. Well, you must see one of these awards. This, I, is, this I, helps. Okay, well, uh, yeah, but I'm never going to be, you know, uh, feel old, no. No? I have to always feel young. That's great. Yeah, you tell us your secret tonight. Yeah, and also to learn. No, but I'm not going to talk too much. Okay, I don't know. Well, when we get old, we got a place for you. <laughs> you got it? <laughs> We've tried. Everybody tried. Even me, I, even me, I tried with the drum too. No, I don't think so. No. I don't know. You sure? You sure? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> no, I didn't see it. Everything is going to be fine. Everything. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't know. But you, you might be told me, okay, you drink too much, Augustine. Drink. Oh, no. Have oh, yeah. another. I'm not watching you. Yeah. You're, not, you're not driving tonight, are you? No. Okay. No. Me, thanks me, God. Me, me neither. Yeah, thanks okay. God. So. Because that's a special time for me today. Yeah. Really you special. Have a because, good time. because um, you know, my family, my mother, get a lot of humiliation, you know, because I'm a drummer in my neighborhood. Wow. Because, you know, sometimes my people, you know, got trouble with her. And cross her, you know. Oh, your son is a drummer. 
you know, your son is going to be a, a, a bomb. In, in Haiti, drumming is... People, it's not so unusual to play. Uh -huh. When I was a little kid in elementary school, mm -hmm. I had a music teacher from Haiti. Her name was Charity Bailey. Mm -hmm. And we all had Haitian drums. Mm -hmm. No, no, but, 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 but I don't know, I don't know about uh, the time and the day, because uh, uh, before 1960 or 1961, 62, mm -hmm. and a lot of people used to cost me out because I was drunk. And that, uh, uh, th those time, um, but I, I don't think I feel I don't have a class. Right. Because the way I play the drum. Sure. And you wanted to do it. I want to do it. So. But, uh, and also God and my spirit. You know, God first and my spirit second. And want me to have the diploma and to help you know, my family. Anyway, the music in Haiti is very, uh, the people love it. Yeah, but no, 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 no. People love it, but but the parents sometimes your parents, parents don't okay. want you yeah, to play true. the drum. Yeah, because they want you to be doctor. Right. We go to school to be teacher. You know. Right. But they don't want you to play music. My younger son wanted to play the drums. And okay. We didn't, we didn't want him to do it. Okay. <laughs> but, <laughs> but it's not because we didn't want him to be a doctor. We just figured we didn't. Yeah. We we had no place to put drums. <laughs> yeah, because um, and. Uh, time I start traveling, because I, I, I go to a lot of places. Right. And because my mother, time I go over, I see my mother you know, with a lot of struggle. And to pay went. Oh, yeah. To pay the house. And I told my mother, I'm, I'm going to help you. How did, she, and, how did and, she feel now? So, and before she died, she happy though. I make her happy. There you go. I give her everything. You know, because one day I told my mother, now I'm your man, I'm your boyfriend, I'm your husband, I'm your everything. But go outside, get what you want, get your love, because me and you can make love. Go get your love, don't go make love for nothing. Right. I'm there. And you'll take care of the rest. I'm going to take care of the rest. That's very nice. But I'm super happy. Yeah. I'm happy today yeah, because, great. you know, and before... I feel like that today, and I feel like that too, that my mother always died, and I'm there for her. Because she told me, time she died, she want me to give her music, to put music on the funeral, to do everything by music. Right, right. And I give that to her. That time I do that in Haiti, a lot of people thought I'm crazy, but my mother told me that. Was she in Haiti or was she in New York? No, on Haiti. She was in Haiti. Yeah, on Haiti. Prince. I'm for the Prince. You know, by the cemetery. You know, close to the cemetery. Yes. You know, oh, okay. By, by, yeah, by, I do. By the right. Close to the cemetery. Okay. Close to the palace. Too. You remember Olofsson's Hotel? Hotel Olofsson, I used to play there. That's where I stayed. That's what you stayed? But I, I, I uh, um, So how long you was in Haiti? Just 10 days, maybe. No, 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 no. Uh, what year? What year? What year? I was there in 73. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've been in New York already. Yeah. You know, because I used to play in uh, Hotel Rooms in 1962. That was a great place. Yeah, 1962. And uh, with uh, one woman, American woman named Lavinia Williams. Okay. Lavinia, okay. she used to dance, yeah. Okay. She used to dance ballet. And she get on Haiti and every, it seemed like people from Catherine Denham. Oh yeah, and you know who else? Mm -hmm. um, the wife of Jeffrey Boulder, Carmen de la Valera. Wait, yeah, you know her. Yeah, I, I heard about her. Yeah, you know, but I, I used to play for a lot of people, you know, because in Haiti we have a lot of different class in Haiti. Okay, right. Okay, you have the high class, you have the low class. But it's not supposed to be like that. But I feel I am from any class. I'm from low class. I'm from high class. I'm from anywhere. Music. music. Oh, that was last year. I'm, so I'm yes, sorry, darling. I didn't mean to be in your way. Time I talk to you like that, um, it's different the way I talk to you. Time I be on stage, I look different too. Sure. You know, because, you know, I have one with them for each um, uh, um, public. 
Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Audiences, audiences. Sure, sure. You know? But I'm sorry, I don't speak English good, but yeah, your English try is to fine. Understand. I got it. So, you know, I'm always, you know, try to really pleasing people. And don't, don't say I talk too much. I would Who said I would? Uh, I would no, no, I, I just, I, you know, would, try to make you I open drink. with me. I wouldn't drink. I want you to open I, with me. Tell me everything you I, want to I'm your host. I would never criticize you for saying too much. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, you know, but, 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 you know, that's make me, you know, really happy. But one thing, uh, time I was in Haiti, and I go play in Petroville. Yeah, I was there. In Petroville, by, yeah. by, by, by the Sacre Cœur. Yeah. By uh, Sacre Cœur, sure. you know, the church. Yep. And anytime I uh, play in Petroville, I see, you know, friend look like you, you know. Uh, um, light skin, because we got a lot of people who have a light skin and hate. Light skin. So I got my light skin inside my body. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> you know, but uh, let's get back, you know, get something. And yeah, we because should. Because you, you play this empty, yeah, yeah. you know? My glass is empty. Look at her. Look at her. Do you remember? So do you like your picture? What is it? The picture. Uh, Annie. Don't make my beautiful picture. So what's your name again? Marty. Yeah. Marty. 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 <laughs> nice headline.
<laughs> He's very charming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 you know, I'm working hard for Haitian culture, man. I'm working hard. Man. I can see that. Yeah, I'm working hard I can for. See how hard? Yeah, for Haitian culture, man. You know, that's my roots. You know, that's why I never, I never want to. I'm, I'm with Haitian. And poor Asian, poor, you know, not more. But Tamatama is poor, huh? Tamatama is poor. Yeah, I know. Um, I'm still feel I'm rich, of course, inside. Absolutely. Because I get my dream. My dream is my dream. My dream. My dream is my, dream is my visa. My dream is my dream. That's why money, I don't say money. I see my life first. You know, my stronger. Right. You know, to play good, to concentrate it good, and money come later. How money, money. How come money. How <laughs> but I keep saying that too. But you see, you you cost billion dollars to me because you you are you know you are happy the thing I'm doing. Yeah. You know, it costs a million dollars to me. But I don't need a million dollars in cash, I need you. Okay. And I need a million dollars in cash. But to help me, to help me, no, no, to help me more. No, 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 to, to help me more. To help me more. Because if you, you know, I, I would I will prefer you to, to have the billion dollars cash now. Right, yeah. And I know you're gonna, give, you're gonna give me at least 100 dollars. Uh, absolutely. Okay. And I'm gonna say, you, you see this guy have the billion dollars? I talk to them on my own ceremony. And I, 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 I got the I got, uh, poil, I be poil, you have it. You know, I be yeah. poil, I be have a lot of fun because you have a billion dollars and you my you friend. Can, yeah. <laughs> Friendship. <laughs> you know, yeah. Price, you know? Priceless. Priceless. You know, it's better than the cash. You know, it's you, good to have both. Because, yeah, My it's theory good. is good to have both. <laughs> it's good to have both. But, but you know, because you know, you know, you know, no, no, you know, sometimes people have a billion dollars and they fight to get two billion. Right. They fight to get ten billion. Right. And the ten billion, you might die. I'm still working on my first day. Okay, but I'm going to help too. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to help you too because, uh, you know, I, I'm going to try to... Get this on. No, no. Uh, yeah, he's helping me with the first No, well, yeah, there. because... We're still you, working no, on no, it. No, 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 because Tamato, you are rich with my music. You know, me and you might do the book. Me and you might make book. Me and you might do something. That would be great. Me and you might do show. You might take me That's to California. Yeah, gotta, you might take me to California and do why, shows. Why don't we do a book? So, you know, I'm waiting for you. What's the book going to be? Drumming. About life, about, about my life too. About patient drumming. Drumming. Okay. And life. You know why, why I, I, I just got to play the drum? Why I, I decide to play the drum? For what I'm learning to play the drum? Drumming. About drumming. About patient drumming. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. And we make it work there. Fine. But one thing, we need money to make money. You need, you need money to make the book. No, the publisher has the money. To make Okay, I need good publisher. I need good publisher. Now that's why I need them. Good publisher. So, 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 so you see below that? No, I don't. Okay, I, I play music in it. Oh, you did? Ah, you see? Okay. We, are, we have a lot of opportunity to make money. Okay. So let me take some more wine. Thank you. So you're still on my back, right? Yes, I'm still here. All right. I can see this is going to be... <laughs> An interesting thing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes. So I'm yes. so happy. I'm so happy you put me on, uh, on your move on the move below it. I'm only I am more happy than you. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm more happy. I'm, I'm no, more happy. I'm happier than you are. I'm more happy. <laughs> I'm more happy. I'm more happy. I'm more happy. As happy as you are. No, because you know, because that, that's the thing I, I say I'm happy because I'm I, I really working hard. 
Yes. 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 And, um, and also, I played drum time I was seven. Right. I played the drum. Right. Um, I never had a situation like this. Right. So, time I continue with the 1972. Yes. When one thing I can do, God bless America. Yes. Well, you know. And also now I teach her on the college. I know. I teach her on the college. Right. But you know, on my own, 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 my
<laughs> Dave, do you know Peter Sarat's no. feet? Oh, hi. <laughs> Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah, that's my animal. Okay, let's go. Okay, hey, hey, how Dave. you doing? You know, Good. Today, of course. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's in that movie. Yeah, right. He plays one of those funny instruments. <laughs>
Now, because this is the People's Hall of Fame, the people are going to get to vote on something tonight. One of the things that we've been talking about endlessly in board and records meetings is, is it better to hold this event during the week or on the weekend? So I'd like to show of hands, all people who prefer this event to be on a Saturday night versus all people who prefer this event to remain on its traditional Thursday night. All for Saturday, great right? <laughs> now, I am the least interesting person you're going to hear from tonight. And I am about to introduce a person whose face you may not recognize and whose voice a lot of you surely will. Isaiah Schaefer <coughs> is a founder and director of the, well, Symphony Space. Yeah, just have many notes. He's a founder and director of Symphony Space, and his duties include directing popular series, Selected Short. It's a celebration of the short story. Now it's 15th season. Thank you. 
neighborhood. Uh, and in my role downtown in City Hall, I'm chairman of the subcommittee on landmarks, and we get to either approve or on a rare occasion veto the work of the Landmarks Preservation Commission preserving some of New York's history. But what we do really is preserve the history of edifices. And while they're very important, uh, what City Lord does in preserving uh, some of the real local history that breathes, that smells, that tastes, that you see uh, move around is really a service. And I want to thank uh, City Lord for, for doing this on a, on a regular basis. It really helps New York City a lot. Um, Shaheen Foods and Sweets is a story that started uh, in the subcontinent. Uh, and uh, the, uh, the family that uh, started the business really came here. They are. You'll be able to taste them later, so you look down and salivate. Uh, the Hamid family started out in India, but were victims really of religious persecution there. Uh, and uh, eventually moved to Queens, in western Queens, and opened the store in 1973. Now, in Jackson Heights, it's a little odd because we have uh, people who arrive in Jackson Heights and Elmhurst from India, Pakistan, and Bangladesh. And those of you who know the history of the subcontinent know that those groups don't always get along. Uh, and yet, uh, uh, Shaheen Suites uh, caters to both the Muslim and the Hindi community. Uh, caters to all three of the nationalities and does it quite well. And it's a great success story. Starting out in a small store in, uh, in Elmhurst, they now have two stores in Jack's Heights, two stores in Manhattan, and one store in Baltimore. So they've really expanded from where they started. And um, tonight to receive the award is uh, uh, Tariq Hamid, who uh, learned this craft, which was passed down from generation to generation, for centuries really, from his father, and, and came to America seeking freedom, and not only uh, achieved freedom, but became a business success. So I'd like to call uh, Tariq up to the podium. Come on up.
perform musically. Uh, I'd like to call to the stage uh, to perform in just a moment after she receives the award two of the real torchbearers of Yiddish song in New York today, the wonderful singer Phyllis Berger. Please come up, Phyllis. And <laughs>
Tenor is at the piano, and Phyllis Burke comes to the microphone. I'd like her to explain a little bit for non-Yiddish speakers the uh, texts of the two compositions uh, by Bela Schechter Gottesman that she's going to perform. These are two uh, bittersweet love songs of the many kinds of songs that Bela has written. Um, the first is Harpslied, Autumn Song. See it's fall, and what was green is yellow and withered. See it's fall, and what had bloomed is gone. And I who thought that spring would last forever, and I held eternity in my hand. Birds call sadly, very well. At the window the rain wails and and moans, oh, how I would be away from here to a shore that's still green with spring. The rain drives like a, a gallop on a wild pony and whispers a secret that he loves me. Why must I wait for springtime when fall offers baskets full of gold? This is hers, and what's the green for guilt for the This is hers, and what's the bleed for
that was, oh, falling leaves, oh, flying days, where shall I wander now when thick fog lies on my way? Okay, I'll be glad. This next song, is introduced by me in a recording that I made with a short piece of a Gordon Jenkins song that I thought set up the song very well. It's called Arege, which means a moment. When you are no longer mine, and I no longer thine, then you once were mine, forever mine, moment. You're leaving, going far away, another street, a strange new day. Yet, as a pair, we'll always stay together for a moment. I count the teardrops in my hand, shining pearls in a strand. Upon my garb, the string I'll hang, forever lives the moment. Yeah. I, my mother left from Puerto Rico. Uh, she was a labor worker. She used to sew, and she brought four kids with her. All of us were grown up in the Bronx. I didn't have an opportunity to see that beech tree, to see that apple tree, to see those wonderful vegetables that were taken out of the ground. I didn't ever have that opportunity. I lived in the Bronx practically all my life. I seen the Bronx go down when it was burned completely. And we decided to develop this wonderful casita as we can grill our joy. Ms. Jean Wiseman, on behalf of all of us and of all our communities at large, we like to say that she brings culture, history back to all of us that are not in our native lands that are here right now. Thank you very much, City Lord. Thank you very much. Thank you, People's Hall of Fame. Ms. Jean Wiseman, we love her. Thank <laughs> you. 
Smithsonian Museum of Natural History, making the house inside the museum. The contractors told us, you cannot build this, it takes two weeks. And we told them, look, we know how to do construction. We come from the island of Puerto Rico, where we used to take the houses apart when the government would come to take them out. The next day, the whole community was built again. Okay? So we did, the, we did the beautiful exhibition of the yard in the Smithsonian Museum of Natural History. So just to say that, we took the casitas from all five boroughs representing all of them and took them all the way to the Smithsonian Museum of Natural History. Thank you very much, God bless you.
luxury lower this company has achieved many goals because of its many volunteers and wonderful patrons who are here tonight and singers like Mignon Dunn saved many a night for us substituting for the singer like she did at the Met. So the young singers and it's the greatest thrill for Sally and me to see these young singers perform what we try to put over to them. It's a feeling that is very difficult for me to explain, to say in better uh, adjectives. <laughs> we thank you very much for this. We hope to continue our work for a long time because the company is making many plans for the future. Assistance taking over some directing, musical direction. Sally, please say something. <laughs> Thanks to the law and everyone attached to it, and all the volunteers and all the wonderful people who came today to see us. Thank you so much. Thank you. It sort of describes Tony Mata and Sally. And I would like to introduce Julian Kwok, who will play for me.
That's nice. They produce an incredible spirit that has brought together people. Like, like Tariq, um, in, in these gardens you have people who, they wouldn't talk to each other if they came from those countries. But in the gardens, when you're, when you're digging for radishes, people talk. And, and, it's, and people work together and people protect what is most important to them. And, well, I think most of us in New York City come from somewhere else, and the gardens are a terrific place to carry on traditions. You see it in how people design the gardens, you see it in how people plant their gardens, you see it in how people use the gardens. And when we talk about the gardens, we really are talking about... And the honorary is Prisoner Augustin, and here to tell about it is an artistic colleague of his, the distinguished filmmaker Jonathan Demi, whose films are so many that include Silence of the Lambs, Beloved, uh, Philadelphia, Married to the Mob, Something Wild, and uh, Swimming to Cambodia, among just a few of my favorites, and Uli's Gold, a special favorite of mine, and an Oscar nominee, as well as the uh, film entitled Mandela. Here to tell us about our next honoree, please welcome Jonathan Devin. Filmmaker Jonathan Demi, whose films are uh, so many that include Silence of the Lambs, Beloved, uh, Philadelphia, Married to the Mob, Something Wild, and uh, Swimming to Cambodia, among just a few of my favorites, and Uli's Gold, a special favorite of mine, and an Oscar nominee, as well as the uh, film entitled Mandela. Here to tell us about our next honoree, please welcome Jonathan Demi. Haiti's historic slave revolution in 1804, and also stereotypes promoted um, since then through 
uh, uh, terrible kinds of pulp literature written by various European authors and also by uh, Hollywood movies, uh, none of which I knew. Um, <laughs> Incidentally, uh, to mention also, if you are not familiar with voodoo, um, you should be. It will enrich your life. And uh, there's an extraordinary show right now at the Museum of Natural History across the park, um, which is devoted to uh, Haitian art and uh, many other uh, interpretations of voodoo. And it's, a, it's an exquisite show. You would love it. Um, I want you please to uh, help me welcome a man uh, who is likewise extraordinarily rich in beauty and spirit. He's a brilliant musician great teacher, and tonight, a most righteously honored New Yorker, the C.A. Frisner Augustin. Thank you very much. My family. To my mother. To my spirit. To God. And to all my friends, my entourage. All my students.
running down the business cheap, but my tears were the tears of joy. I am very delighted to be here, to take part in this special celebration. Um, Fisner, our master drummer, has been with us for nearly a decade. During those years, Fisner has never stopped encouraging his children to take pride <coughs> in their culture. Fisner always talks about the culture. He wants them to take pride in it because our culture is one that teaches respect and cooperation. It is his hope that these youngsters will cherish these values wherever they go and no matter how far they go. Fisner is really very dedicated to keep the Haitian tradition, the Haitian culture alive. And the only way to do this, to have it accomplished, is to pass it down to the younger generation. Because culture dies like the people. We have to share with the youngest ones. Mr. Augustine is not only our drum drum internet guy. He is a teacher, he is a, a performer, he is an inspiration. My son who is sitting right over there is learning to play the drum from Mr. Augustine. He is my instructor. He is their instructor. Because we cannot perceive Haitian dancing without the drum. Like the drum, Fisner is our photometer. He is very essential to our group. Fisner, we want you to know that we are very proud that you are a member of Tonelata. Always remember that we will always be proud that you are a member of Tonelata. Congratulations. And we congratulate you on behalf of all those children that you have worked, that you have seen one for ten years. We congratulate you on behalf of their parents, and we have parents representatives here. We congratulate you on behalf of the entire Haitian community at Saint Augustine Parish. Thank you. <laughs> I would like to thank the staff at City Law for giving us the opportunity to be with them tonight. Thank you.
Those things got my name.
Get the shirt, okay? Yeah. You got a shirt? I'm getting dizzy. <laughs> You were in there, yeah, yeah. You're in there, all of you. You're not in there. Yeah. There you go. Yes. Oh, yeah. You got the shirt? Look happy. I'm sure. I didn't get your face, but I got the shirt. Brothers. No. Yeah. Literally, when I just bought mine, I mean, I like every, why am I behind everybody? I'm supposed to be ahead of everyone. When I bought mine, I go to the bathroom and I go like, <laughs> film my, because I never saw myself actually in the action. Oh, this is a good shot. Oh. Okay.